All right, today we're checking out April Wine. We're listening to the song I Like to Rock. Let's get into it. Okay, but what do you think? I like it. I like it, and especially the part where they harmonize and they're like, they're like, Stop! like they're like mission, mission together or whatever. I don't know. It sounds like different, but I can't tell you how it sounds different. What do you mean? You know what I mean, it's like the nuanced differences. Like it just sounds different than like a typical American rock band, but I can't tell you specifically how. <laughs> you know? <laughs> it's just because you know it's Canadian. Probably, if you didn't know, you but, would not be saying this. But like, but like Scorpions. Something a little bit different, you know what I mean? Something I don't know. Something about it sounds different to me. Doesn't sound just like Okay, see if you can figure it out by okay. the end. Okay.
Okay. I think I know what it was. What? Um, to me, it sounded like they were in like a higher tuning than like most standard classic rock type songs. You think that's why the audio just sound different? No, I mean, I think it was the production quality, like, or this, like, whatever recording this is, maybe it was, I don't know, it was not the best recording quality, but I think their tuning, like, up until the very end solos, they pretty much didn't go, like, any lower than, like, a certain note. Like, I can't really make the note. Okay. You know, I think it was, like, higher pitched, but without being just high pitched, without being, you know what I mean? To me, it just sounded like a higher tuning. But not that high, because it was really high, I wouldn't like it. No, it wasn't super high, that's the thing. It's like, it was like like a sort of standard tuning, but it was just like a little bit tuned higher. That's what I think, at least. Maybe I'm totally wrong, but I think that's what it was. And at the end, I think what came in was like the basses, maybe those were the solos, because it was deeper. Yeah, that was it. live and in color at the end. Yeah. Like not the very end, but right before that, the sound was completely different. Yeah, yeah. To me, it sounded more like what I would expect. Yeah. But then they also had the like back and forth, so maybe it's like a really older song. Mm. Oh, did you like it overall? Yeah. Yeah, I thought it had a good sound. I just wish I could hear I like, could turn a it up. remaster or something. Yeah, like you know? I wanted I thought to be, it was I wanted to be loud. Overall it did have a good sound. Yeah. I'm like, that's the kind of song that you need to like have the walls vibrating. You know what I mean? No. Yeah, because it wasn't it wasn't too high pitched. It wasn't too. There is too... no song that needs to vibrate the walls. Definitely, that song would sound great. If you want to be deaf. Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> Definitely. Deaf. Yeah, that's that's <laughs> why I said if you want to be deaf. Oh, look at you. <laughs> Your cheese look ball. Look at you. And you just had to make it weird. <laughs> I don't know. Tell me, man, what do you know? What do you know? Me and my boys on the road. She told me, boy, you the go. Like, I don't know.